Martino tragedy has prompted the cancellation of Steeler training camp today and tomorrow. One of the team's coaches suddenly and unexpectedly died. Bob Pompiani joins us now with more on who he was and how the team is being affected. Bob. Well, Paul, it's never easy to go some, uh, through something like this. The Steelers were stunned and heartbroken this morning as they were getting ready for what was to be a full day of practice on what was also to be a family day for the team. As you know, a football team is a family, and this news was hard to take. Daryl Drake, the wide receiver's coach, at age 62, suddenly dead. The tributes were quick to emerge on social media, where Coach Drake was remembered for being a terrific coach and developer of young men. But moreover, he was remembered for being a much better person. The fields of St. Vincent College are normally filled with players and fans. Not today. The campus was empty. Empty like the feeling players had in their hearts about the news that broke this morning. Popular receivers coach Daryl Drake was suddenly gone. But his work on these fields with these men will never be forgotten. Team President Art Rooney II issued a statement, quote, we are all at a loss for words following Daryl Drake's passing this morning. Daryl has such an impact on the players he coached and everyone he worked with throughout his entire career. Our prayers and thoughts are with his wife, Sheila, his three daughters, his grandchildren, and entire family during this difficult time. Mike Tomlin brought Drake to the Steelers. Quote, Daryl loved the game of football and every player he ever coached. We will use our faith to guide us and help his family through this difficult time. My heart and prayers are with his wife, Sheila, and Daryl's entire family, end quote. Juju Smith-Schuster worked closely with Coach Drake. He posted this on Instagram today. Coach Drake was honestly my favorite coach that I've ever had in this game. He taught me so much about football and especially how to go about life. Coach was an amazing role model, not just for myself, but for a lot of people who he touched. Thank you for all the memories and life lessons you taught me forever in my heart, end quote. Drake was also very instrumental in the Steelers drafting Toledo star and second round pick wide receiver Deontay Johnson. He's an exciting football player and he can stop and start and he can make people miss in open space. Today on campus, flags at half staff. Flowers were placed at the fans entrance as the news spread. Sean Bromstead and his wife drove to Latrobe today from Virginia. Looking forward to practice when they heard the news. Heartbroken that uh, we weren't practicing today, but uh, really stunned to find out uh, that Mr. Drake had passed away. So uh, he's been a great receivers coach for us. Uh, done a lot of good things with Brown, Juju, and uh, Washington's looking good so far this year. So that's a very tragedy for the team. It really is. No word on cause of death at this moment. No word on arrangements. The Steelers have also canceled practice for tomorrow. So for now, they're going to return to the field on Tuesday and practice there Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Daryl Drake, by the way, was only 62, and we extend our condolences to his entire family. This is Bob Pompiani, KDKA News.